the big boy. How'd you like that intro? I thought that I overslept, but it's daylight savings and I'm up unexpectedly early. Today's off to a very productive start. I've got laundry in and I've set a timer. Well, what are we doing today? We've got a gig today. I'm in a bass clarinet ensemble and it is an ensemble comprised of all bass clarinets. It's really cool. Bass clarinet has a huge range. It can play super low. It can also play super high. So I got the music actually. We're playing for a church service. Um, I am bass clarinet three. The way that band parts go is you wanna be first chair. With bass clarinet ensembles, the one through whatever just determines how low or high you play and how like prominent your part is. All parts are important, but sometimes there's like a solo or a melody line that's in the first bass clarinet part. Also bass clarinet one tends to play a little bit higher and bass clarinet, say, Four, plays like the bass lines and everything else kind of fills in. We have a piece written for like 14. So, it, it, and it's not just like 14 plays like the lowest, like everyone is all over the place. There's voice crossings all over the place. It is a really cool sounding ensemble and I'm really happy to be a part of it. What we're doing today is just a quartet. So it's four, we're doing a couple of like church pieces. I'm not exactly, sure how it all fits in, but I'll know after today. I'm actually not gonna practice the music until I get there because I have some other practicing to do right now with really tough music. And the music for the gig today is very easy. So we're meeting about an hour ahead of time just to like rehearse it together, the four of us. And then the church service begins. And then I believe we are going out to dinner after everything we have the rehearsal for the bass clarinet ensemble instead of me saying bass clarinet ensemble bass clarinet ensemble which is seven syllables i'm going to be saying improbable beasts which is only five and that is the name of the bass clarinet ensemble improbable beasts i'll link a thing in the comments if you want to listen to some of the pieces i'm not in any of the youtube performances yet because i'm a relatively new member the director of the bass clarinet ensemble is john russell and he is also a composer and weird sort of crossover situation my quintet the calliope reed quintet we are playing one of his pieces in our upcoming 2022 season so the music world is vast but also tiny i only have an hour to practice and then we'll get ready for the concert people are sometimes wondering what we use as musicians as wind players for ppe and that my friend comes in the form of a bass clarinet shower cap it's just like a little cover that goes over the bell so between that and my silly looking mask, we should be as protected as possible. It's shower time! Oh, oh, uh, okay. I unfortunately don't have enough time to straighten my hair, which is my preferred hairstyle. So I'm gonna take you through my curly hair routine if you haven't already seen it. Curly hair routine, let's go. First, we gotta brush it. with the mousse on it. We're gonna get dressed, woo. 
So getting dressed for concerts is actually really easy because we're just wearing black today. So I've picked out a dress and a blazer to wear today. So I'm gonna go put this on and I'll see you in like two seconds. One, two. Okay, so sorry about the lighting. It's kind of dark in my room, but we need some jewelry now. Okay, um, okay, so because it's church gig, we kind of want to go subtle. Like sometimes I'll wear these because they're huge and they're fun and they're sassy. But because it's like a church, maybe we'll do like some black. Or we could be the Empire. Nope. Here we have our necklaces. And this cute little like music note one, is that cheesy? I usually don't like to wear things on my wrists, but if it's something that's like small, I'm like this could be cute. If I wear something like this, they're like really noisy, you know? So I don't like to wear bangles because also they slide all over my arm. I don't really wear my engagement ring a lot because I don't like anything on my fingers when I'm playing. I'm still engaged uh, <laughs> in December. It'll be engaged for um, two years. Trust me, getting married is on my list of things to do. It's just not very high right now. All right, time is of the essence. So we're gonna do a super quick makeup routine. makeup look if only doing my makeup took that amount of time I wouldn't want to wear perfume because we're like sitting like closer together and in case anybody's like allergic to it or whatever but body spray I feel like just kind of like it dissipates after a while it's more for me for some performances I, I would have gone like all out with the eyes like I would have done I've got like black I've got glitter I've got colors but this is a church gig so I went with my everyday makeup, which is just like some sort of, sh you can't, you can't see it. And we've got our hair. All right, this is a whole other story. Like, like it looks so like voluminous and curly in the front, but then like when I turn to the side, it's like flat in the back. I hate that. I mean, that's just my, my hair is very fine. It's very thin. Texturizing like sea salt spray. I don't like it when like all of a sudden there's like a part in the middle. I just kind of keep it piled up in the, in the middle of my head. So excited. This is like a really, really low pressure gig. So I am like not sweating it at all. Let's go. Giggity, giggity, go. All right, so this is pretty much the final look. We've got a dress black dress with like a very subtle like polka dot pattern. I don't know if you can even see it. We've got the blazer over it. And then we've got black tights and little booties. A dress is comfortable. Nice slouchy blazer is comfortable. I just have to figure out what jacket I'm wearing. Should I wear my Michael Kors trench coat? It's not really trench coat weather, but, but it's a beautiful jacket. I'm gonna do it. That's the stuff. It's actually like too warm to wear this right now. It's like 60 degrees, but when I get out of rehearsal, it's going to be um, like in the low 30s, which for Celsius people is around zero degrees. I've got to get rolling. So the next time I'll see you will probably be at the church. I thought it was a good idea to let you know how much a bass clarinet weighs. So a bass clarinet weighs between 30 and 50 pounds, depending on the brand and the material it's made out of. Mine is made out of wood and metal. The case that it's in is a pretty lightweight case in terms of like bass clarinet cases, but mine is probably around 40 pounds of clarinet. So when I have my 40 pounds of bass clarinet and I'm carrying my B flat, my A double case together, it's probably around, you know, 50 or 60 pounds of clarinet. Anyways, let's roll. Here we, oh dear. Um, my hair's looking feisty. I'm in a weird mood. All right, let's go to church.
do a hot take. Um, the concert went really well. It was super low key. I was so cold because they kept the doors and windows open, so I was freezing. I've been freezing since 3 o'clock p.m. Then we went out to dinner and it was really nice. We walked in the freezing cold. I deeply regret not wearing any pants. I'm wearing a dress, uh, but that's okay. And then, um, then we had rehearsal and it's freezing. <laughs> I've played bass clarinet for like another four hours today. So that's great and all. No, life is good when you have a bass clarinet and I just saw some of my bass clarinet friends and we had rehearsal, rehearsal went really well. I am freezing, so I'm gonna go home now. Bye. Three, four, five, six. Wait, who's uh, six? I'm I'm six. I wasn't ready. I'm good. Okay.